I'm a little nervous having the dark fluid aboard the ship. Apparently, there's a non-zero chance it could destroy the whole galaxy. But then again, we lose Super Earth. What hope is there for the galaxy anyway? Our greatest minds have designed a weapon with the capability to destroy a planet. With it, you will cleanse the galaxy of the abominable hive that Meridia has become. The Illuminate basically handed us this planet-destroying superweapon. Doesn't seem too bright for a highly advanced alien. Guess that's why they're dead now. The destruction of a planet is a tragedy that cannot be undone. But our enemies leave us no choice. An entire planet compressed into an infinitesimally small point? Well... That's what happens when you resist the will of managed democracy. Yeah, I've done a little reading up on the dark fluid, and it's actually pretty simple. Exotic matter with negative mass amplifies the force of gravity, varies with local energy density, etc., etc. I won't bore you with the rest of the details. I'm sure you get it. Helder, in the hour of our desperation, we may yet find salvation, but it will come at a terrible cost. Watch your step, Helldiver. We've got dark fluid on board now. One thing goes wrong, and we'll all be spaghettified before we know it. I've been thinking. E710 comes from bugs and powers our warp drives. I wonder what happens when an entire planet of bugs gets compressed into an infinitesimally small point. You are to deploy the dark fluid an illuminate technology discovered at the end of the First Galactic War. This exotic material yet holds many mysteries, but for now, we will use it to secure Liberty's future. Meridia is destroyed at last. The threat of the Terminids is vastly diminished, but we cannot rest. The Galactic War is far from over.